Okay, geocentric versus heliocentric. Of course, geocentric or Earth-centered is the idea that the sun and everything else orbits around the Earth, and heliocentric or sun-centered means that the Earth and the other planets orbit around the sun. And that's the main idea of those two models, but there's a lot more to the story. The old dead Greeks that originally came up with the notion of a geocentric model also believed, for example, that the heavens are eternal and unchanging, and that everything in the night sky is perfect or blemish-free, and that planets moved in perfectly circular orbits and never sped up and never slowed down. So when you read about Copernicus and Brahe and Kepler and Galileo and Newton, keep all that in mind. When Tycho Brahe observed a supernova, that was a huge change in the night sky. Last night, there wasn't a star in that spot, but tonight there appears to be. That's an enormous change. If the old dead Greeks were wrong about that, about the heavens being eternal and unchanging, who knows what else they were wrong about? And when Kepler discovered that planets moved in ellipses rather than circular orbits, again, if the old dead Greeks were wrong about that, what else might they have been wrong about? Galileo used a telescope to look at the night sky. Now, Galileo did not invent the telescope, did not invent it, but he was the first person to use a telescope to look up. Before that, people had used telescopes to spy on the enemy troop movements or maybe to peer in their neighbor's windows, but Galileo was the first to look up with a telescope, and he noticed that the moon had mountains and craters and blemishes just like the Earth did, and that Venus went through phases that don't make sense if Venus was in orbit about the Earth, that Jupiter had its own moons that orbited Jupiter. So again, as you're reading about the contributions of these uh, astronomers from Copernicus to Newton, keep in mind you want to be able to describe their contributions in that context, how their contributions and their discoveries cast doubt upon the old geocentric model and help to usher in the new heliocentric model. Good luck.